School rules. We've all had to follow them, and let's be honest, we've all tried to break them at some point. From the moment we step into the classroom to the time we graduate, these regulations shape our educational experience. But there's something about being told what to do that brings out the rebel in all of us. Today, we're taking a trip down memory lane to explore the top 10 school rules we all tried to break. Number 10. The dress code. Whether it was rolling up our skirts, wearing band accessories, or sporting the latest trendy hairstyle, many of us pushed the boundaries of acceptable school attire. Schools aimed for a professional learning environment, but students saw it as a chance to express their individuality. Number 9. No running in the hallways. The bell rings, and suddenly everyone's in a rush to get to their next class or, better yet, lunch. Despite teachers' warnings, the temptation to sprint through the corridors was often too strong to resist. Number 8. Raise your hand before speaking. In the heat of an exciting discussion, or when we just couldn't contain that perfect answer, blurting out became second nature. Teachers' reminders to raise our hands often fell on deaf ears. Number 7. No food in class. From discreetly passing notes with pieces of gum to sneaking bites of a sandwich during a lecture, eating in class was a covert operation many of us mastered. Number 6. No cell phones. As mobile devices became more common, so did the struggle to keep them out of sight. Whether it was texting under the desk or sneaking a quick game during a boring lesson, many students risked confiscation for that digital fix. Number 5. No talking during tests. The urge to ask a friend for that one answer we couldn't remember was sometimes overwhelming. Whispers, past notes, and elaborate hand signals all made appearances during exam time. Number 4. No skipping classes. Whether it was ditching gym class or taking an extended lunch break, the allure of freedom often outweighed the risk of getting caught. Number three, stick to assigned seats. From the back row to sitting next to friends, the desire to choose our own spots was strong. Seating charts were seen as challenges rather than rules. Number two, no cheating. While morally questionable, the temptation to peek at a neighbor's paper or create elaborate cheat sheets tested many students' integrity. And the number one school rule we all tried to break. No leaving campus without permission. The outside world called promising adventure and freedom. Whether it was sneaking out for lunch or skipping the last period of the day, the urge to escape school grounds was often irresistible. These rules, designed to maintain order and create a productive learning environment, often felt like unnecessary restrictions to students eager to test their limits. Yet, they played a crucial role in preparing us for the structured world beyond school walls. Looking back, our attempts to bend or break these rules were as much a part of our education as the lessons themselves, teaching us about consequences, creativity, and the complex balance between individuality and social norms.